So, John, I was talking to little Jackie. There's a fine boy you got. If he's mine, of course he's yours. It's the truest of gifts, a child. Yet you push him away. I ain't no kind of father. I wish the boy no harm, but well, you know how we live. We live free. If you say so. How you doing there, partner? Fine. You've had a run of bad luck, huh? Morning, Arthur. Blackwater, and then, uh... Sure. Was Blackwater really bad luck, though, Dutch? Or you and Mike acting real crazy? You tell him, Arthur. Tell him to wake up. He's lost something. Blackwater was about surviving, John. Not for that girl at work. You okay? I was on that boat. I saw what Dutch and Micah did, but he won't admit it. We can't change nothing now. Pinkertons, eh, John? So it seems. I mean, I thought this place was a republic. What happened to the notion of states' rights, of boundaries? Transcontinental mercenaries pursuing us? Don't seem quite right. What do you think, Arthur? Oh, you. Seems like we robbed too many powerful folk. Well, I guess we did. But they all seemed to deserve it at the time. The Golden Boy. How you boys keeping? Good. Them scars are still pretty raw. <laughs> New ones or the old ones? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, Marston. Uh, you are so tough with them scars. How'd you get them scars, John? Uh, being tough. <laughs> I ain't tough. I'm either stupid or slow. I cannot decide which. Either way, I keep getting caught. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. What do you mean? Seems like you've been getting caught by a few things. Not just wolves and knives. <laughs> ain't nothing ever caught me Dutch didn't want to eat me. Well, exactly. I think that's the point. Listen, I didn't get these scars falling over in church. Not yet, you didn't. Just what do you mean, Dutch? Oh, I've had better days. Come to bed. Come on to bed now. I guess I should be going to bed. Don't you be an arrogant son of a bitch, John. You're better than that. Love gets us all in the end. You be grateful it got you. The man talks drivel sometimes. I guess. I wish I had a scar. You okay, son? Yeah. Sure. I don't know. You don't sound okay. They're chasing us, Dutch. They're... They're chasing us hard. Sure, they're chasing us hard. Because we represent everything that they fear. But if we stick together, and we stay tight now, there's gonna be tough times ahead, I can promise you that. But we are going to make it to paradise. Paradise? Yeah. I ain't never gonna leave you, son. Don't you ever leave me. Knowing that, that's paradise. Maybe. No. 
Not maybe. Maybe is doubt. Doubt is the end. Yes, Dutch. Say it. Yes, Dutch. I know it's hard. I know it's hard. But together, we can achieve beautiful things. Alone? We're sickly bison, waiting on the wolves. I trust all's well. Mr. Marston. Dutch? Oh, it's nice to see you happy. Happy? Mm. Playing at family is beautiful. Why are you being strange with me? Just remember, the gang comes first. We fight for each other. That's all I'm saying. I don't... I don't really know what you're talking about. No. No. <laughs> I'm just being silly. Odd. You know me. And I know you. Good cup of coffee always gets the gut. I know you. The perfect image to start my day. What's his problem? I have no idea. You're quiet. What are we still doing down here? Thought we was heading west. We live free. You know that. I don't need no noble savages speech again. And have you forgotten that we came down here to get your son back? I look after my own. Can you believe this ingrate, Arthur? Like, he ain't gonna agree with you. You always said he was too smart. Don't forget who you are, John. Morgan. Why didn't you come get me? I told you, time weren't right. Are you doubting me too, Arthur? The pair of you depressed me. They was gonna kill me. I thought... I thought you thought too much. You are precious to me, real precious. But next time, let me do the thinking. And I just do the hanging. You just do what I tell you, and we'll be fine. We ain't dead yet. Remember that. Clear off, Arthur. You're starting to annoy me almost as much as him. Arthur? I couldn't leave him in there, Dutch. You disobeyed me. I'm sorry I made a call. You're gone, Dutch. Just be quiet. No, I need to be left alone right now. So gone, you can't even see it. Who do you think you are? You need to snap out of this. I've had enough of this. Ungrateful bastard. Okay, son. I get nervous, boss. Me too, son. But we'll be okay if we stick together. You don't think we should scatter? Scatter? We have a problem to solve. We solve it together or we die alone. We run. 
They'll pick us off. One weak, desperate fool after the other. Ain't that so, John? I guess. I guess one of these days we'll find out. Come on. Both of you. A little faith. A little faith. Remember what I said up at the bridge. When the time comes. I will. Because it's coming. You think I don't know what you're saying to people? I just don't know why we're doing any of this. Why? Why? Because I say so! I am done explaining myself to you! You want to be the general! You don't have the grit! Grit? That what you call this? Black Lawn. How did the Pinkertons know about the bank job in San Denis, John? You want to tell me that? If you really think that, you are gone in the head. Oh, and here's the other one. I raised you as sons. Goddamn snakes! You are losing it, Dutch. John didn't rat us out. How you two fooled me all these years. This is Micah's doing. I know it. <laughs>